Hey guys, Mama Bear is back, and I was going to go to quick save it so that way I could go ahead and pick up where I left off. And I'm gonna just have to do another episode right back to back under the circumstances because you can't quick save. I wonder if I walk towards it if it'll freak out. You're really stuck, aren't you? Okay. Yep, there we go. Sorry, didn't mean to get you all wet. I just saw that and I couldn't leave it in a glitch. I had to unglitch it. Okay. This is just crazy. So yeah, Mama Bear's doing an episode back to back for two different weeks. Was not planned this way. Gotta love it. <laughs> but anyways, we're just gonna continue on like it's nothing but a chicken wang. Like the buffalo ones. Those are like really good. I love buffalo buffalo style chicken wings. They're some of the best. Now I'm kind of wanting a buffalo Seems chicken. Cool met the same fate as you. I don't blame Yermos for talking. Spartans like the most basic empathy. Stay here. I'll kill the Spartans, destroy their ships, and free your crew. I should try to stay out of sight. Get away from here! This is no place for you! Yes! War! Okay, here we go. Come on. Nope. before I go and do that. Did I loot everybody? Okay. Cool. Just wanted to make sure. Okay, I think I might just fast travel. Oh, I can't even fast travel to the address here. What? Okay. Well, I've at least moved him there. So he's now in the center.
Oh, this mission's crazy. There's so many components. There's sharks. Of course, there's sharks. Is there any on this side? Oh lord, why does it have to be sharks? Oh, get to the boat, get to the boat, get to the boat, get to the boat, get to the boat. Look alive, everybody. We got work to do. Welcome back, Commander. Ah, no, I pressed the wrong button. Of course I did. Master. Enemies are close. Get ready. Okay, here we go. There we go. Come on. I will get you. There we go. Now, believe it or not, my controller's actually been shaking this entire time. I don't know why. It's like been vibrating. Well, that's going to drive me crazy.
Okay. Weird. It is still vibrating. Like it should not be vibrating right now. <laughs> this is odd. Maybe it'll correct itself when I talk to this guy. So far it has not. A great service. On my return, I will make sure to acknowledge it. What in the world? More than that. You will have earned the favor of some powerful people when they hear of what you've done. I hear it's useful to have powerful friends. The way the world is now? Weird. It's still shifting. What do you mean? I've said enough, and my sheep awaits. Thank you again, Mistyos. I hope we'll meet again. That was a very long mission. Oh, crap. Alright, guys. I cut the video for a second so I could go to my PlayStation menu and it stopped vibrating. And as soon as I got back into the game, it's vibrating again. Craziest thing. I don't understand what's happening. Maybe that's why I didn't charge. Maybe there was something wrong with it on the... Man, I just bought RZB a brand new controller. Now I might have to actually get me a new controller too. This is crazy. Well, it stopped again. This is weird. I'm just going to go ahead and fast travel because I really... Even though I'd love to go ahead and check these, which I will with this... I'm going to see if I can't reset the controller with a fast travel and whatnot because this is really weird. It's driving me nuts because it's literally shaking my arms. It's not like the powerful because I just have it on like a normal vibrate for like more of the intense moments but um Yeah, it should not be doing that. Like, it's not vibrating right now because I'm in the load screen, but if I pop in and it starts doing it again, I'm going to go crazy, I think. I don't get it. <laughs> so weird. So very, very weird. Okay, as of right now, it's not vibrating. But look at the house, like the, the roofs on the house. That's weird, right? That's kind of how my controller felt. <laughs> it was like that right there. It was like vibrating, like. <laughs> not that I should be like trying to explain it that way. But it's not vibrating yet. So maybe I fixed it. Maybe just load screen and fast traveling. If you have that issue, could potentially fix it. Mama Bear will keep you posted if it happens again. And kind of let you know when and what I do. You can't help it. Sometimes things just happen. Okay, here we go. Maybe it's the whole mission itself. I don't know. Maybe when we talk to him, it'll start again. <laughs> I hope not. I hope I did fix it. You took far longer than I expected. There were complications. In what way? Your messenger was dead by the time I arrived, but I was still able to free the captain, and the ship sailed. So, I still did the job. Ah, oh, poor Yerimos. But I should be thankful for your initiative. You don't seem very concerned about poor Yerimos. Every struggle has its sacrifice. 
Jerimus played his part well. What's in Mytilini that's so important? People. We need as many allies as we can gather. Okay. This was more than I bargained for. You'll be amply compensated. You have done me and the people a huge service. One day you will see your part in this great world. Alrighty, quest complete, and so far no no issues, so that's good. Um, let's see where we're gonna go next, guys. So weird. We have this one here on high horse. Okay, so we can do that, or we can kind of complete more around here. But I think we're going to go ahead and work on this one. Maybe I can complete some of these question marks right around here. So I'm going to go ahead and just quickly go through the inventory since I'm already in here. Haha. -ha. Compare Hunter Fire. Okay, I'll go in the Warrior. So that's still a decent bow. There we go. It ups everything. Damage with swords and daggers. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. See, I've been waiting and holding out for exactly what I want. Not that I'm actually wearing it in the game, like that you can see, but why did I do that? <laughs> I don't know. Because I hadn't gotten to my abilities yet. I haven't even started doing that. Oh, yes. Let's do it. Yeah. Oh, wait. I always press L1 or R1 instead of 2. I don't know why I do it, but I do it. It's a habit. Okay, so here we go. I hope you guys have been enjoying everything we have been doing on the channel and everything we've been um, adding and putting together and things like that. I know we've been, like our ZB has been adding a lot of lives uh, as well. Now that we've kind of got a lot more content out there, we want to start focusing on doing lives and connecting even more with you guys. I've been giving you more opportunities to connect with him and jump on, chat with him if you'd like, um, while we're live and stuff like that. So that's what that's for. And, um, yeah. Best stay out of sight. Okay, yeah. I'm not too worried, but I will get out of there. I have made a few tweaks to my content, um, like the intros, 
it being pink instead of red and then turning around and doing the mama bear picture the rogue zombie mama bear picture instead so that way it kind of helps you guys know right in the beginning if you don't happen to be able to check or see who it is if it's not more clear it'll kind of show you who's doing which ones we try to make sure that we're very detailed and very precise with our things but yeah it's hard to believe we started this like just a couple of months ago I never would have imagined we'd already be where we're at with like the content and already the connections we've built with um, our subscribers so yeah we've been absolutely loving every minute of it it's been really cool I mean we've been able to play with people around the world and talk to people around the world and that's just something we actually never thought we'd actually be able to do. Did I just pass it? Yes I did. <laughs> I just got caught up in talking to y'all. <laughs> Sorry about that. Now I just got to load for our conversation. But yeah. It's a nice horse, Socrates. It's a very nice horse. A sturdy horse. It's also a stolen horse. Socrates the horse thief. I can almost hear the stories they'll tell. Aristophanes will love this. Unfortunately, those stories would be entirely fabricated. Although, I would like to see if you believe the story should still be told once you know the truth. What story is that? There is a man nearby who is responsible for stealing the horse. I've been contemplating the proper course of action, but I'd like to know what you think is right. And how should I make my decision? Your thoughts are your own, but speaking to the thief himself may help you decide. Can such a crime be justified? It's an interesting thought. Where is the thief now? I told him to wait by the stable southwest of here. If you caught him stealing a horse, what's to say he won't just run away? The hope of keeping the horse. That's where you come in. I'll let him tell you the rest. Yeah, I'm heading the right way. I wasn't 100% sure, but I felt like I was heading the right way. I'm not running into anybody. I don't know why you guys keep gasping. Yeah. Uh. 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 Uh
Without a trace. I just ran that one, guys. Now it's just war supplies. Question is, where's the war supplies now? That was weird. Okay, there we go. Oh. Are you the one who stole the horse? Socrates said I should talk to you. Bad enough being caught, but to have a Mystios judge me. Better than an Athenian guard. Anything to say? The man I stole it from won't even miss it. He has plenty of others, while my only horse died last week. If I had the Drachmi to buy a new one, I would have. Did you steal the horse to use it, or sell it? I have a family to feed, and this horse will help me on the farm. Plus, I have no other way of traveling right now. There's no other option? Not that I could think of. Trust me, I feel shame for what I did. Any reason you picked this specific horse? It was the easiest one to take. Other than that, not really. Though, I did make sure it wasn't his best horse. A courteous thief. I didn't steal it for fun. I did it because I had no other choice. I have enough information to make a decision. I hope you can understand. Wouldn't you do the same if it was your family? Alrighty. Come on, I can do this. Yeah, I sure can.
Oh my goodness. Whoo! Get you. There we go. I don't know where the bobcat is. Ah, oh, there it is. Yep, there we go. Okay, now we can go do this. Almost there. There we go. Have you decided? I was going to say. stole it from let him keep it it'll do him more good so determining whether a crime deserves a consequence or reward is dependent on the reasons behind it an intriguing thought although I can see how dangerous such thinking might be the real question is whether my decision matters at all or if this was just another test to see what I would do there is a good chance it is both but an equally good chance it is neither now you're not making sense on purpose. Let me ask you one more thing. If one man kills another in order to save many, can his actions be considered just? Or should the man be punished? If the action was for a good reason, then he is in the right. So, in times like these, people like us get to determine the law. Many would believe a murder still deserves consequence. The people whose lives were saved would disagree. Then perhaps making choices that affect the most people for good is a correct path. Wouldn't you agree? Are we done yet? 
I can't stay here all day. Of course you can't. <laughs> it's a luxury few can afford. Even those with the time for it often lack the mental capacity for such things. Okay. Alrighty. So there we go. Now we've completed that one. And let's see. So let's see what this is. I don't like question marks. Question marks don't sit well with me on my map. We will find out what this is and go from there. They'll be watching for me. I need to be careful. Okay, so just loot the treasure. So I just need to figure out exactly and something tells me it. Well that one was easy. Alrighty, and there's another question mark not too far away. So let's see what that's all about. Might as well, right? We're right here, and it could be just as quick. Captain and loot. There we go. And that is now complete. Okay, so let's see what else I've got on my map. It looks like it's just this now. So let's go ahead and head there. It's a little bit further, but at least we finished everything else. Like I said, I'm kind of wanting to do just a few kind of like complete the smaller stuff. And kind of do completing of the map and filling things in. Almost there. A lot closer than we used to be. We're more than halfway, I think. Cause 
because I want to say it was like six, almost seven hundred, if not seven hundred. Almost there. Little bit further. Okay. Let me get close and see what we have to do. Bandit leader. Okay. Oh, this won't take very long at all. There we go, those two are freed. Not the prettiest way to do it, but... Oh, I did lose them in here. That's funny. Oh, dang it. Oh, sacrifices. There we go. What do we have left? Just one more treasure. Which is probably down here. That would be my guess. Okay, maybe not. Then it's got to be, oh, up in there. I already see the little picture, the icon. Come on. Get up here. Ooh. 
What? No, stay up there and go up. Thank you. There we go. I'm gonna grab these two. And basically from here, there we go. All right, and now we've completed that. I hope you guys have had a good time. Sorry about the little craziness and everything like that. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Mama Bear out.